He has a passion for diving, that's why. Like, he bought NASA science stuff. Oh, yeah, it was my shirt. Can't wait. He developed, like, technology NASA uses to, like, really search the wreck of the Titanic and stuff. That's all James Cameron technology. He brought them all out there. I'll start the story from here next time. It's like James Cameron's the lead in the Titanic research. Always being capable of being research. Good for James. Yeah, you know. He does some good things. Can I just, climb down and get back up? Yes. But he's just got a passion for diving. That's probably what he's here for, I think. He's just to go underwater and have a good time. But he needed his movies to find that fun bit. <laughs> Well, yeah, you don't get the SS Cameron for nothing. The big research vessel that shoots photon torpedoes out of it. That's amazing. That'd be, it would be a fan of the thing. I think he does have like a, a ship. He's pretty hilarious. I got another sand tank over here. Just the thought of James Cameron is hilarious. I mean, totally respect the dude, but... You gotta wonder what it's like to work with. How much do we have? Me? What kind of budget do we have this time, Chase? Well, I don't know. We're feeling about 500,000. Maybe a million. Are you, are you sure? Oh, uh, yeah. That's your cup. $65 million. Wasn't <laughs> <laughs> that how expensive? Yeah, it was. It was pricey. I think Avatar's only like 600,000. I don't think it's that crazy. I can't open the gate! Well, that's too fucking bad. You're gonna have to. Whoa, yeah, epic, I lose my shirt. Epic running cutscene? How do you lose your shirt from falling? I have no idea, but I lose it. And I it. You missed the rock. Crush my dad. Sorry, I was having a thought about Avatar for a second. That's not until I realized, like, you watch so many horror movies on Netflix, but your suggestions come up on, here, maybe you'll enjoy this, and it's like a whole bunch of horror movies, and Avatar The Last Airbender cartoon. Makes you think about, like... Wait, what? So, on, you know on Netflix they have the suggestions for you? Yeah. And, so like, if you watch a lot of horror movies, they kind of come back to a bunch of horror movies. That's what happened to me. But the first thing on the suggestions was Avatar The Last Airbender. The cartoon, not the movie, thank God. <laughs> but still. I was kind of surprised. Cool, now I'm sure you're right. Yeah, the world's a better place. And then I'll get my black sword and uh, life will be fun. I hope you don't lose your pants. Uh, no, that's gross, man. Oh, yeah, for like 237 movies. Make Avatar. Over the course of 14 years. The dollar must have really inflated. How much did it cost? 237 million. I told you it was ridiculous. Oh, it's a little about average. Got Revenant there that spent 135 million. Fuck that movie. <laughs> But you gotta think of like his profit income if he spends two hundred thirty seven million with an additional nine million for another for a second release. He makes two point seven billion dollars, almost two point eight. Like what does he do at that point? He just laugh at life. Like he go home, smoke you, a cigar. Do you run for president? I would. <laughs> <laughs> or Arnold become governor of California. I don't know, these are just thoughts you have when you This want. game is way better with sound. Yeah, I bet. I can only imagine it. What the noise is. Like there's a whoosh sound and a whoo land. Can we make our own sound effects? <laughs> Hiya! Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I was afraid slash, for a Slash, 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 slash. Please don't be any big hard guys I can't deal with. Hold on. Slash. 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 He's a great musician. Slash. Can't wait to do Guitar Hero. Yeah. That'll be an experience for the ages right there. Okay, 
he's the blocker. So I can jump over him. Dude, did you almost jump? You jumped over a guy and killed him? What is this, the beginning of the game? <laughs> yeah. Look at all the blood on the floor. This is probably the scariest part of the whole game. Yeah, that's probably the best game with the best part of the music. It's the only part with music. Well, there's been a couple parts. Playthrough is actually really quiet. I was kind of concerned when I edited it. Were you? Yeah. Is it really bad? Oh, commentary is good. It's just you get a couple of gas from your girlfriend. It's the fucking uh, game. It's not our fault. <laughs> Get a couple of gas from your girlfriend, and <gasps> and you make a couple sexist comments, and then a uh, crazy oh the guy I was worried. <laughs> oh no, 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 you. And, make, and then there's a couple crazy version songs that play that are mixed in with some this, rock, and that's about it. This game really fucked itself over. Yeah, like the first the PS2 version was amazing. Believe me, it did what it needed to do. Maybe. Or just the HD remake didn't bring the sound over quite as well nope. as it should have. Because they didn't have a sound guy. Well, they, did, they had a sound guy, but it was the intern. It was first day. Will you do this for 12 bucks? And you said yes, because it gets me into the industry. <laughs> and then they released it before they showed the people who was funding it. And he's like, this is great, but the sound isn't. And he's like, you should fix that before you release it. And then they get released yesterday. And then he's like, oh, okay. And he was like, oh, I feel responsible. There goes my budget. There goes my money. All you had to do was change the game's graphics to high definition and you, went, you screwed it up. Get some water. Drink my water. Some wawa. You know? Oddly enough, I don't actually remember this room in the original. You blocked it out with all the chains. The chains and whips. Yeah. Are you going to press the button? Hmm? Are you going to press the button? I think this box open. Yeah. Hold it down, you know? Ah. Very good, very good thing. How much progress have we had? I mean, it's kind of interesting. We're almost done. But once we get to the bath scene, that's the last part before the final ball. Yeah, we're almost done. So like the last boss is 15% of the game? Jesus. That's commitment to the game design right there. That's another thing. I thought that said on the armpits. <laughs> well, you Sorry. did lose your shirt. You look something. Anyway. I will marry her. I'll tell her the first chance I get. It's time we put an end to all this fencing about and not saying what one really means. If we've made it this far, it's foolish to deny what we both feel. Yeah, that's what you tell me. She's a nice girl. Sorry, I meant Lebanese. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not actually Persian. <laughs> Fly to us. Imagining that there's like a rough scraping noise. There was in the original. From that block being moved. Now you're going whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. Now you're well, it's fucking. Is this a river of blood? No wonder I don't remember this game. It's not a river of blood. This isn't Silent Hill. It's Prince of Persia. It's Fruit Punch. Duh. And a lava noob. A new bis from Egypt? The dog thing? That guards the pyramids? The weird god? I might need more water. I guess there's probably going to be a fight. It's not. Avatar is not just a science fiction film, it's an epic science fiction film. Is it? Yeah. Is that what they put in That's the That's what world? Wikipedia has classified it as. Avatar? Yeah. That really fucked me up when Avatar came out. Because I remember Avatar the show. Yeah, and I'm Last like, Airbender. Yeah. What? 
And they made the movie that no one ever talks about for good reason. Fuck, really? Yeah, it was a really bad one. I talked about it. I know you are. Yeah, so it says here development. I'm just going. Development. What? I can't. Sorry, go on. Development of Avatar began in 1994. Really? And was released in 2009. <laughs> <laughs> That's freaking ridiculous. That's beyond ridiculous. That's that shit. It was planned to release in 1999. Ten years before it did release. Can you imagine just waking up every day and your wife's there and she's like, What are you gonna do today, James? 